This bandit silver bullet express money train is rolling. Choo 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 choo. Next up, money valve. With VIP seating, only 25 seats on this train. With VIP seating, in seat number one, Claude. Seat number two, Jason. Seat number three, Salvador. Paying with their donation through PayPal. Thank you for all your support and appreciation. Money Maker Bandit. Be sure to like, subscribe, click the bell icon, make a donation, support the channel. It's good karma for you, it's good karma for Bandit. We have all our good karma. We get on the money train, count our money. Next up, money mail. Choo choo, choo choo. Money, money maker bandit. With the early bird special, this early bird special video. But more important, bandit has the new bandit bankroll system for all you players out there that are beginners or new and need some help with your bankroll band has a new bandit bankroll system okay this is for all you players out there the bankroll between two hundred and fifty and one thousand dollars. So two hundred and fifty, five hundred dollar bankroll, seven fifty and a thousand dollar bankroll. Okay. Now for a two fifty play uh, bankroll player, your one unit play should be eight dollars. Eight dollars only for your one unit place. And if you're playing uh, quarter unit place or quarter star place, you should only play three dollars. So 250 bankroll, one eight dollar units, and three dollar quarter quarter star place. Five hundred dollar bankroll. You should only be playing fifteen dollars for one unit place, and four dollars for a quarter unit play. Seven hundred fifty dollar bankroll. You should play twenty dollars one unit place, and five dollars for the quarter unit place. One thousand dollar bankroll one unit plays are twenty five dollars and quarter unit plays are six dollars okay write write all this down if you're a 250 bankroll 500 bankroll 750 or 1000 write all this down all right band has a two unit play what should you play you need to be disciplined in all this actually perfect discipline follow this and you won't get in any trouble. You'll build your bankroll slowly. You'll go from a 250 bankroll to a 500. And you go from a 500 to 750. 1,000 will go from 1,000 to 1,200. You just keep moving up. You just follow the system. All right? Bandit system. Okay, where are we? Okay, uh, two unit. Bandit has a two unit play. If you're a... Uh, $250 bankroll, you should play from $12 to $15 only. $500 bankroll, you should be playing on a two unit play, $25 to $30 only. $750, you should be playing $30 to $35 only on a two unit bandit play. $1,000 player, bandit has a two unit play, play between $35 and $40. All right? Now, bandit has his four unit plays. What do you play? Four unit play. You should play. 250 players should play between $16 and $20 only. Be disciplined. $500 players should play between $30 and $35 only. Okay? On a four unit play. Write this down. Everything down. Write it all down. All the different bankrolls because you're going to move up. If you're a 250 player, you should know the $500 system. Bandit system. Okay? 
Where are we? Four unit play, $500, 3035. Your $750 bankroll on a four unit play you should play 40 to $45, okay? If you're a $1,000 player, four unit play, you should play 60 to $70. That's it, on a $1,000 play. Ben has a four unit play, all right? Now you fall, you fall, you be disciplined, perfect discipline. Okay, two unit play, $500, $500 player. I mean, $500 bankroll, what are you playing on a two unit play? $500, 25 to 30. Okay, you come into the Bandit Cafe, you have all this written down, you look at the menu of the day, ask Bandit, say Bandit, what's on the menu today? Oh, 15 fade or no fade games. I'm a $500 bank bankroll. Okay, so you want to play two, you want to play uh, two uh, quarter quarter fade or no fade games with a $500 bankroll. You could go four dollars and four dollars. Okay, man has a two two a two unit play today. Your $500 bankroll, you can bet from 25 to 30. All right, so be disciplined. Now let's see this discipline. Just in the last few days, say on a on a thousand dollar player, going back just to Wednesday, going back just to Wednesday. Okay, you had a four unit play on a thousand dollar player. Okay, you had a four unit play Wednesday. You had a Phoenix blowout winner, but a four unit play. So say 60 to 70 on a thousand dollar player. Say 60, okay? So you won 60. Thursday, LA. Well, you all weren't there because you got thrown out of Bandit's Cafe for disrespect. But anyways, if you were there, 60. So that's 120. Friday was a Lana blowout winner, two units. So a thousand dollar player, 35 to 40. So say 40. So that's 120, 160, right? Saturday, you had. Amir Abizi, two unit play at one, minus 110, two unit play. What's that? 40, so that's $200, right? Denver, you had four, Denver NBA, so four, four unit play, that's 60, that's 260, okay? Then you had Connor. Bandit made a mistake on that, sorry, shouldn't have been an eight unit play, should have been only a four unit play. Let's say it was a four unit play, you have 260, you lose, you lose that four unit play on Connor. Now you have 200. What happened Kansas City? Next day, Sunday, you have Kansas City. Bandit gave you Kansas City four unit lock of the day. Winner, $60. So you have $260. So a $1,000 player since Wednesday, January 20th, playing the Bandit system, bankroll system, now is $260. You're up to $1,260. You're, half to, you're halfway there. In five days, you're halfway to $1,500 bankroll in five days. And you could play the same way a 250 player, the same the same system, a 500 player, all those games. Okay, you're not going to win all those games. Just giving you an example, okay? But this is the system to follow, Bandit's bankroll system. Why is Bandit teaching you this, coaching you up this new system? Because it's good karma for Bandit and it's good karma for you. If there's 20 of you out there that are regulars, not regulars, I won't say regulars, we'll say, if you're a Bandit team member out there, there's 20, 30 of you, if you don't know how to do proper bankroll management, what happens? In three months, maybe 10 of you are gone. So out of 20, there's only 10 left because bankroll management. But if Bandit teaches you a perfect bankroll management, a bankroll, a bankroll system, right? Then what happens? In three months, there's 19 out of 20 of you still here. Okay? That's why Ban is teaching you this new bank bandit bankroll system bankroll system. Ban the bandit bankroll system, okay? Because in three months, six months, you're still gonna be here. You're gonna have bigger bankrolls. And what are you gonna be doing? You're gonna be donating more. So then Bandit benefits, you benefit, you're building your bankroll. That's why he's teaching you this. So write this down. The Bandit bankroll system is for 
$250 minimum bankroll. Most of you have, everyone has a 250. If you don't have a $250 bankroll, you have $100, save up, wait a, wait a month, and then once you have $200, $250, then you start playing the bandit bankroll system, okay? But if you have a $250, $500, $750,000, just follow this system perfectly. Perfect discipline. Not, okay, not, oh, I'm going to go 12 here. I'm going to go, no. If you're a 250 player and you're, and you're, and you're, it's a one unit play, you go $8 every time. Not 10, not 12, $8. If it's a two unit play, you're $250 and, and you, you could play between 12 and 15. You don't go 18. You don't go 20. Perfect discipline, okay? If you're $250 bankroll and it's a four unit play you should play 16 to 20 you don't play 25 30 you play between 16 and 20 okay perfect discipline this is how bandit built up his his bankroll okay just like this because i'll tell you what bandit used to do bandit could always pick winners he could always pick winners this is what bandit used to do bandit used to okay bandit used to uh, win 10 games, go 10 and 0. On the 11th game, he would lose. So he'd say $100 a game. He's up $1,000, okay? 11th game, he would lose. Lose 100, right? So he's he's now 10 and 1. On the 12th game, Banner would get upset and go like 1,500. So it would be 10 and 2 and minus $500. How can you be 10 and 2 and minus $500? It's not even possible. All right? Or in uh, 2004, Bandit built up a bankroll from the end of March to the beginning of April to April 6th. Bandit built up $500 bankroll, NBA and college, from $500 to $25,000. On April 6th, you can Google it, Portland played um, LA Lakers, favored by 10 points on a Tuesday, April 6th. Bandit had $18,000 on the Lakers. Guess what? Lakers lost. Man lost eighteen thousand dollars. Well, he didn't actually lose eighteen because he had twenty-five, and he still had three in his account. So he actually made ten thousand dollars from five hundred. But that'll never happen with the bankroll system, okay? Like on this Connor mistake, some of you bet too much. You said, "Oh, eight unit play. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play a uh, hundred dollars on. It. I have a two hundred dollar bankroll." That's why Bandit's coming out with this system to show you, so you won't get out of control. You'll have discipline. So did you write all that down? Go over it again. All the numbers are there. You stay within the, the system. If you're a beginner or even at, uh, intermediate, sports better, follow this. Even if you're above average, intermediate, follow this system perfectly. Perfect discipline. And in three months, six months, I just showed you. A thousand dollar bankroll in the last five days would be at twelve sixty. What do you think is going to happen in the next ten days? It's going to be at another two hundred. All of a sudden, you're up to fifteen hundred. You know what happens when you go to fifteen hundred? You can increase your bets. You're at two thousand. This sixty to seventy could be one twenty to one forty. If you're a thousand dollar player, two th you go to two thousand. This thirty five forty for two units, you could go to seventy to eighty. Okay. Just adjust the numbers. Anyways, that's the Bandit bankroll system. We got a game now, Early Bird Special. So if you find benefit for all this, make a donation. How many of you were on Kansas City yesterday? Four unit play. Lost on Connor, but one on Denver NBA yesterday. One on Kansas City today, the UFC. Want the UFC won a two unit play Saturday. Amir Abizi. Okay, anyways, college basketball. Early bird special. Radford versus NC Asheville. Man's playing Radford plus two points. Uh that's the first half, is it? Anyways, Radford, first half plus two points. Alright. Yeah, it's first half. Radford, first half, early bird special. All right. Uh, leave a message in the comments or email bandit. 
at moneymakerbanditsportsgmail.com. Let me know what you think about the new bandit bankroll system. All right, Moneymaker out. <laughs>